Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, let's look at the 21.2 FL beta uh, version that just got released. And uh, I want us to just pick out two things that really caught my interest. Inside uh, this FL studio, you know, with their recent beta released, image line introduced a service called FL Cloud. FL Cloud simply is just like having your supplies accounts inside FL Studio. Another feature that really captured my interest, you can now separate stems inside FL Studio. And that is what we will be looking at today, just briefly. But if you want to try this out, I'll be leaving the link to where you can download the beta version. Let's just quickly go straight to the option here which is the cloud when you open fl studio when you download it and open it this is where you see the cloud service that they newly introduced when you click it you will see it will request you to or uh, it's gonna request you to log in yeah when you click on that it will request you to activate it better and you click on it all you need to do is to put in your fl credentials and you have access to it for now that is still in better version you can access all the packs free you know according to what they said on the site unlike before if you want to get a sample pack like a loop or a kit from people that produced it you need to go to the browser log into the website and choose the one you like download it and bring it back inside fl studio but now it is very easy because everything is inside fl studio with the help of this uh, fl cloud service you have tons of sample packs loops one shots and all that right inside fl studio this is a really good idea for fl to incorporate it in their door so that is that about the cloud the next thing that really caught my interest that blew my mind actually is that you can now separate stems inside fl studio all you need to do is to drop your audio inside the playlist and head down to this corner and you will see the option there extract stems from sample so once you click it okay i need to download it but i've not downloaded it so once you click download and download it it will bring up a menu like this one here so you choose whether to split everything the voice the bass instruments or you just select the ones you want you know and click ok and does it so guys like i said it's a quick one just want to share it with you guys and let me know what you think in the comment section if this drives you to upgrade uh, for me definitely i will so guys that will be it for today's video stay creative and see you guys in the next one bye for now